Greetings, everyone. So I've shown you the Brinkley 3100, which is right next to this one. This one is a 24 Brinkley Model Z 2900. So it is a four seasons camper, meaning you can camp in it all year round. Dry weight, you're looking at 11,958. Overall length, 34 feet, 11 inches. Uh, because you guys always ask, fresh tank is 75 gallons, gray is 90, black is 45. You can sleep four people in this unit. It does have three slides. I want to talk about a few things. First, we do have a slide here on the camp side. So you'll notice we have a second awning. Both of those awnings are powered awnings with LED lights. We've got modern square Euro frameless windows, super sharp. Um, up here at the front, you are pre-wired for a 55,000 or a 5,500 generator. I forget all, uh, basically you're wired for a generator is what I'm trying to, trying to say. Um, you're, you've got your two slides on this side. Sorry, I went blank after I struggled with that. Then I want to show you your command center out here. So as you see, you can basically do Everything you need to out here, all your hoses and stuff will run right up through there so you can close this off. That is a heated um, and insulated pass-through storage, which is super nice. What else do I want to talk about out here? This is automotive grade graphics. You do have a ladder on the back, so it is a fully walkable roof, meaning you can get up there and clean, maintain, do whatever you need to. It does already have the backup slash rear observation camera on it. And you'll notice there's additional storage. There's 130, over 130 cubic feet of exterior storage on this. It does have 370 watts of solar, and I think it's prepped for 750. Um, yeah, yeah. So let's go in and check out the inside, since I'm spacing it so much on the outside. So on the inside, you'll notice when we talk about those slides, your living room kitchen slides are 76 inches tall. So you have nice tall slides in here, which is absolutely great. You'll notice in the windows, you have the integrated window screens, and you also have insulated blackout. Dual flush floors. So you'll notice everything is nice and flush in here. 5,000 uh, BTU fireplace, which if you watch any of my videos, you hear me talk about them all the time. I love it, especially if you early season, late season camp, or if you camp in the winter. We'll definitely take the chill out of the majority of the camper, which is super nice. 50-inch uh, flat screen TV that is telescopic. We have our theater seats, and I love just like the little things. Like you even have a wireless charging port there. At the back... We have our trifold sofa, so that's going to provide your additional sleeping. So you've got the end tables on each side that will become nightstands at night, additional storage up above. And I forget what they call this AC system in here, but I love the blower on that because if you really want to direct some AC directly in here, you can. Or if you push that up, you're actually going to run that through the ducts, which is nice. We have our freestanding dinette over here, a uh, booth on one side that does offer storage. And you've got your freestanding chairs on the other side. Uh, we're looking at a 16 cubic foot fridge. I guess I'll show you that real quick. Super sharp, love the all black. Plenty of room for all of your grocery needs in there. You've got the large three burner stove, 30 inch micro residential microwave you do have um a ton of storage if you look here next to the stove you've got a bunch of storage you've got storage up there next to your microwave you also have storage down here underneath your kitchen island with a huge stainless steel sink and i don't know if the color is going to come across but it, it, i shouldn't say stainless steel i think it is but it's like um a gray very very sharp and it goes beautiful against like this brass color that you see elsewhere you also have a massive storage cabinet over here with adjustable shelves 
There's over 20 receptacles in here for plugging in stuff. There's another one right there for your coffee slash breakfast nook. And as you can see, again, more storage. As we make our way up to the bathroom and the bedroom, you'll see we've got a nice deep cabinet here that you can put your outside games, whatever, hang your jackets, dog leashes, so on and so forth. You also have additional storage up here at the top. Nice deep storage up there. Our bathroom. Oh, you know what? I, I left off a couple of things. Hold on. Let's go back down here. I always forget these features. I love these little things that they've done. Like, if I can get a hold of it. Dog food and bowls. This is great because you've got a nice place to put those and store them. When we come over here to the kitchen, we have dual trash cans. One of my wife's biggest pet peeves when we buy a camper is where do you put the trash cans? You've got dual here. You also have your paper towel holder here, which I think this is really ingenious. Like you can leave it like that. Or if you're entertaining, you can actually set it up on the counter like so. Pretty ingenious. But I, anyway, love the dual trash cans. Okay, so now back up to the bathroom. So we come up into the bathroom. You'll see we've got places to hang our towels. You also have a toilet paper holder, which is super nice. Speaking of toilet paper, you've got a porcelain toilet. That means you can clean that with any of your household chemicals that you have. You've got nice big storage here for all your towels and linens. And I love this shower, stand up shower. But look at the shower head on this. Like it takes care of everything. And it also has a detachable sprayer. Nice big uh, bathroom sink counter with a ton of space. You've got storage below, pass-through bathroom. So now we're coming into the bedroom. We do have a queen bed that does have storage underneath it. I looked it up. It's a nine-inch memory foam bed. I haven't tried it, but it actually feels very, very comfortable. Nightstands on both sides of the bed with reading lights and power. So you've got plenty of room for CPAP machines, whatever else you need. Tons of storage up above. You've got a 32-inch TV back here in the bedroom. Second AC, again, ducted. Uh, anyway, TV. And then you have all of this closet space over here hanging, as well as uh, drawers over here. Absolutely beautiful. I love the colors. I love how everything was thought out and laid out in this. They've done a magnificent job on this one, just like they did the 3100. And of course, their toy haulers, which we have several videos of those if you want to check those out. As always, if I miss something, there are so many features in this camper. I know I missed some stuff, but if I, if I glazed over something you want to know more about, please don't hesitate to drop a comment down below. I'd be more than happy to answer your questions. Have a fantastic day.